Objective for today, Tewksbury Railway Station. This is on the line that went between Ashchurch and Malvern. And we've been here before because I've actually filmed the whole of that route in a previous video. By looking at this photograph the other day, thinking you cannot lose a structure like that. It has not been built over, has to be something there, doesn't there? Worth another look. Tewksbury Abbey just to give you a little bit of a feeling for history. Good start. Today's salubrious entrance through there. And uh, this is the main entrance in. Which brings us into here. This is the main car park entrance. Station car park. That's quite a waste of space uh, quite close to the town centre. But as you can see a problem is access. Not that that would worry a bulldozer I suppose. I bet there's a circular in there from a double glazing company. Which will make this then the station platform there and platform two. Now are there any other signs? I can see it here, I'm not sure you'll see it in the camera. That's where the platform tapers down there. That's the platform end, edge. This is where somebody stood to take the photo. We'll wonder see if we can find the other end of the uh, platform. And that'll be about there. It's getting very hard to discern on the camera. It starts to dip about there. Which gives us that as being the station. Two track. Not a passing loop or double, I'm not sure. Still make out a few stones that the platform was uh, built out of. And some there on the point of the Malvern side. No sign of a platform edge. Have a look over here. There was just a simple shelter on this side, and that looks for the world like the base. Now a picnic spot for hobos by the look of it. But that I think is uh, quite significant. Some bricks making up the wall on the far side. Wonder which is getting devoured by a tree. And a piece of ironmongery leading out over the bank. The building is slowly slipping down the bank piece by piece. Not that much of it's gone anyway. That's a good start, but the main buildings were on the opposite side, the Tewksbury side. Have a look. The sunlight's giving us a raised section here, running along there. Could be the foundations of a wall. I've tried to get into it, but it's impenetrable. Piece of old ironmongery sticking out of the ground. Signpost of some sort. From here it's possible to make out sort of raised bits, which could be foundations. I've just had a dig in here. And all I've got is dirt. About a little farther on. A definite wall in here. I didn't bring my Tony Robertson kit. And that continues along through there. Walking towards the platform, we've got an edge here. That's probably a door entrance since we're away from the platform edge, so it's not a platform edge coping stone. Good find. 
hundreds of people, thousands, no doubt, standing here waiting for a train. Platform edge just there. I've just walked along now to the north end of the platform once again. I hope you can see this tucked away in here. It's the original fence. See the main diagonal spar there, and there's another one to the left of it. If that comes out or not? Original fence, not good. Ah, there's some more in there. Centre screen. I wave about a bit. Might just catch it. Heading back train like through the station. Oh, we're running out of places to look now because it's pretty much overgrown. Two free platform. Quite well defined there. And one last rush about. And we've cut shrimps. A wall of some sort. That's concrete rendered, so I'm not quite sure what that would have been. Ah, the car park is there. So it's some, something to do with the uh, structure, no doubt. Looking towards Ashchurch in this shot. And if you look at the tender on the locomotive, near the top edge, you can see beyond it a structure, and that is the signal box. Now, what's the chances we can find anything there? Got to be worth a look. Standing on the platform end, and looking towards Ashchurch, from the second photograph, you can just about make out the signal box. So it's down there somewhere. Go have a look. Just a last look along Tewkesbury Station. Now we head this way. Ooh. Guess anybody? This is an important reference point in the search for the uh, signal box. This is where the line split. That way goes on down into Tewkesbury, into the centre of Tewkesbury, to the quay. This is the line that went to Malvern. So this is where they split. And the signal box was between the two, right down this end. Go and have a delve. A lot of it hold. Off to the side. Foundations of the signal box. A gap there for the uh, signal wires, no doubt. And then this large space just of here would have been the rods for the points. Railway heritage shown in the construction. A few more there. Those rails have actually been used on a railway somewhere before they're in, integrated into this. I wonder where that was. Down that end again you can see the notch for the uh, signal wires. What a find, not beautiful. Well that about wraps it up I reckon. Can't improve on that. Now you're right, some of this was a cheat because I filmed some of it before. I've done a video on Ashchurch to Marvin. So if you go to my channel Parkinson's Walks, click on videos and you'll find it in there. But it's a day out and a bit of, bit of extra interest. Oh, right by the side of the path here. If you enjoyed that, join me on the next one. And meanwhile, if you could click subscribe, like or share, that would really help the channel. Thank you.